Hello everyone, we're going to be building a plant shop today and I actually already did a flower shop um, but this is going to be another one and I'm putting this stall and it has those hanging plants on it that looks so good and I put those two panels and then I'm putting um, this window design on the other side and I feel like that looks so good that um, white one actually looks like it could be for a greenhouse so that might be another build i can do actually because th that's like perfect for a greenhouse so i'm adding some plants and i added that really really pretty cherry blossom branches that it's called and i put the um garden chair so yeah and i'm moving everything back because i want to have more space in the front and the reason why I picked to put this um, flower shop here is because to the left you can actually see that's where I keep the flowers already. So I was like, okay, we can just put the flower shop right next to it and then I could just keep my flowers there. Um, yeah, it looks really good. It already has flowers, so I was like, let's just build this um, right next to it. And then I put the wedding welcome board to be the um sign that just welcomes you um and it actually really goes with the flowers flower shop and i put the garden garden wagon that looks amazing i actually customized everything to be like lighter colors so yeah And today I filmed a video. It is, um, because it is the bug off today, I filmed a video of me doing the bug off and this will, that video will probably be out after this video, I believe so. So yeah. And then right here is actually the place where you buy the potted flowers. So yeah, I just have like that little display. I have the, the bonsai shelf it's called. And then right there I have the log bench. And then I put a bunch of different potted flowers. And right here is like the cash register place. So I needed to get a typewriter to be the cash register. So that's basically where you check out and you, if you buy plants, obviously you need, that's where you get, that's where you check out basically. And then that's the typewriter to look like a cash register. And now it's time to put the pond code, which I downloaded because we have so many new slots and I was like, well, maybe I have the space for another nine slot path, but it's kind of, it's kind of like wasting it because I'm not sure if I like the way that it looks. I think that it looks really good and I don't think I'm going to delete it, but I'm going to probably change out the middle design. It's a lily pad, and you'll actually see what I'm talking about But when I fill in the middle. But I feel like, obviously, I, I have the middle as a lily pad. 
and it just looks too like it has too many lily pads in the middle you'll actually see it like right now i'm, try I'm about to start filling it up and see like i have a lot of lily pads in the middle and i need to just have one that's just water and instead of just two lily pad lily pads i need to just have one that's just water in the middle so i'm pretty sure that the creator has just the middle being the water instead of just lily pads i'm gonna have to exchange one of the lily pads which i'm probably gonna be doing this the bigger one i'm gonna keep i just need it to be water because it just looks like too many lily, lily pads is way too repetitive so yeah and i'm putting this really really cute board walk no board steps and i wanted to like have one that was different so i put that x um planks just to not have it be too many um at the same in the same pathway but yeah i really love that color and i like how i put that x in the middle because it gives it it just looks more natural and n again not too repetitive and i'm actually moving these flowers so that it looks better right now it looks really wild and over here i'm going to be putting plants actual flowers that are in the flower shop so it's going to be in a line You can actually see the lily pad design like it is just way too many like see right right there that looks really like too many so i need to fix that it looks really bad but i really do like the design of the pond i feel like it's really cool because you can you can add waterfalls in this game you can add um ponds but they're never detailed it's just like water i just love how colorful this one is it has the fish in it and I really do like the li lily pads, but it is very repetitive, but that's kind of like my fault. I need to see if the creator actually has just a regular water space for the middle. And right here, I'm putting a fence. It looks really, really good. I love how it's just a white fence, and I actually really like how there's a gate to get in it, and then there's just regular fence. And that's a great way to frame in the area. I really like that. And I actually didn't put any trees um, around this area. I just felt like it looked pretty good. Usually I put so many trees uh, all around the areas that I do. But for this one, I felt like it looked really good without trees, so I didn't add any. And here is the finished area. I just absolutely love those panels that I used, the flower ones and the greenhouse ones. They just look so stunning. And I actually just love all the codes I use, like the stall with the, the hanging flowers looks amazing. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in another video and keep up with my next speed build.